Darkroom's digital media file feature is a great thing and can be used in a variety of ways. One of the more popular ways is to output a file with borders and backgrounds intact from a green screen event or other event. In this example we're using, we have a green screen event and we're adding a portrait background. We've got one package and that package is one 5 by 7 and four wallets. We'd like to also have a saved file at the end of the night so that we don't have to go back through all this again and could publish it to PhotoReflect or have the photos available for reorder later. So let's go back to the Setup tab and go to our Package group, in this case Event, and here's our package, and we have one 5 by 7 and four wallets. Now we'll come over to Add Local Print Item, and under the delivery, uh, Digital Delivery Products, you'll see Digital Media select that then we can go first of all and browse and tell it where we want the file to be saved and in this example I'm going to save it on my C drive to a temp folder now what that means is anytime I output one of these uh, files it will save it in this folder the next thing is you want to check permanently apply attributes that saves all of the borders backgrounds etc with that green screen photo. If you don't check this option then the photo will be saved without those borders and uh, and that won't accomplish anything. Uh, the next thing is you decide on the size. You can have one of the presets which is a small preview size, medium size, or the full size the actual resolution that you're shooting in your camera or you can uh, choose a custom size and define it that you'd like. You can also choose if you want to add a watermark or not and uh, let's choose save then we've got in our package one five by seven four wallets and a digital media file now then when we go back to our workshop and we're ready to print this image if we choose our package it's going to add a five by seven four wallets and the digital media file and it'll output that to that temp folder as i showed you